And we welcome you from the Inara Sports Complex in Pasig City. And in just a few moments, we will have our men's division match here in the Philippine Superliga Grand Prix featuring the Sistema Tooth and Gum Care uh, squad going up against the Maybank Tigers. Of course, Sistema Tooth and Gum Care and Maybank still looking for their first victories in the tournament. Hello and good afternoon to everyone. My name is Noel Zarate alongside Chiki Pablo. And before we begin this game, tell us about the appeal of the men's game and how it's growing with our audiences. You know, this is really a welcome treat for all of us here, you know, to having a men's division because we've always been used to watching the female in the UAP, NCAA, and then even after, you know, it's all women's. But now it's kind of different, something to look forward to because they have higher jumps, stronger serves, stronger hits, attacks, and and um, yung camaraderie rin nila inside the court is different also from the women. So everything is different from the women's. Well, if you haven't watched our men's division yet and it's the first time you're going to watch, you are in for an exciting matchup because these two teams have yet to pick up a victory. Let's take a look at our first uh, team right here. We are talking about, of course, the Maybank Tigers. Now, the Maybank Tigers went up against the Gilligan CC Kings, and the Gilligans won in straight sets. But there were a lot of heroes from that uh, group, especially Jasper Dorador, who scored nine points in that game. Actually, Ivan Bacolod actually did score 10 points. He was the only player in double figures in that game. An excellent setting all around from uh, Jan Lee, uh, from uh, Jan Lee uh, setting up the uh, sets there. But again, Hamza Bin has also been very, very good. Uh, in, uh, in his debut here in the Philippines. A former member of the Malaysian team works in Maybank, Kuala Lumpur. And as a team, they had a total of 28 uh, excellent uh, sets against the 34 of Gilligan's. As you can see there, Hamza Bin, uh, he's been quite a revelation here. Talk about the transfer of technology from the Malaysian national team to the Philippines. And I, he brings that. That's right. And you know, I was informed that he took a one-month leave of uh, absence from his work right. in, in Kuala Lumpur so that he could join the tournament here in the Philippines. Well, let's see if they can actually get their first victory. Now, talking about Sistema Tooth and Gum Care, we'd like to call them the Smashers, of course. They opened on opening day against the uh, PLDT squad, of course, led by Richard Gomez. Yeah. And PLDT came away with also a straight sets victory. How about Rocky Onrade uh, finishing with seven points in that matchup? And also, we also saw PJ uh, Rojas, who also came away with nine points in that game. You can see PJ Ramos, uh, PJ Ross, rather, with that wicked jump serve. Very, very powerful in his attacks. He almost obliterated the defenses of PLDT. But the hero for them, the star for them, is former UAAP MVP AJ Pareja, the six foot four center out of Ateneo, who was the only player in double figures in that match with 10 points. Now, you have the question now does Renz Ordonez, uh, their setter, have enough uh, ammunition for AJ Pareja and the rest of the crew? You know, I think uh, after a week of training, I think they have adjusted very well to each other. I was informed that their training was from three to four times a week. And so I think by now they're able to gel together and they're able to work well together. They practice communicating inside the court. So I think he's got the ammunition he needs for this game. Well, one thing's for sure. One team will pick up their first victory here. That's and right. we are not alone in this broadcast. We are joined now by the third member of our panel, Denise Tan, with a very special interview. Go ahead, Denise. Yes, right beside me is the Philippine Super League president, Mr. Tat Suzara. Sir, um, we're used to seeing women's volleyball games all the time. I want to know what the reason behind this, um, including the men's division this time. Well, uh, there was a demand during the last season, the PNDT. They asked for my, uh, what's this, uh, uh, opinion on having a men's team. So I go, why won't you set up a, you know, a men's team? So Sabi said, okay, we, we will organize a men's team. And then uh, Richard Gomez came to me also. He was a guest. So I said, hey, Taz, uh, why won't you organize a men's team? I said, okay, we'll start with four. So finally, uh, at the last minute, we had four teams. And I think it's a, a good uh, comeback for men's team uh, to have, uh, what's this, this, this type of league, you know? Uh, most of the players are MVPs in the OA, UAP and NCA, and I think it's high time also na hindi lang women, so we're returning the men. Para na medyo this equal gender for this sport. All right, thank you, sir. Back to you, Noel and Chiki. Uh, thank you very much, Denise. And in just a few moments, of course, we will have the matchup between the Maybank Tigers and the Sistema Smashers. Stay with us right here. This is the Philippine Super League Grand Prix on Solar Sports.
referee. Second referee, Mr. Romulo Reporsado, national referee. Now, let us meet the starting lineup for Sistema Tooth and Gum Care Smashers. Starting with number four, Dexter Clamor. Number nine, Rocky Onrade. Number five, Angelo Espiritu. Number 12, AJ Pareja. Number 10, Michael Zamora. Number 18, Chris Masai. Libero is number one, Renzi Hu. Head coach is Coach Kim Rebel. Now your starting lineup for the Maybank Tigers. Starting with number three, Eiffel de la Pena. Number seven, Muhammad Ali Hamzabin. Number eight, and team captain, Janli Patrona. Number 12, Ivan Bakolod. 15, A.J. Maliari. Number 17, Jasper Adorador. Libero is number four, Ken Uka. And head coach is Coach Vic Patrona. So for today, it will be Vic Patrona calling the shots here for the Maybank Tigers. Uh, Sans, of course, yung uh, kanilang normal coach na si uh, Ariel Atendido. And uh, it will be very interesting to see how he can coach his younger brother, Jan Lee, in this, uh, in this matchup. But very um, interesting also, Chiki, for Sistema, they are not starting with their team captain, Renzo Ordonez, at center. Yes. They are actually, uh, at center rather, they are going to go to uh, Dexter Clamor. Oh, they're going to try a, a new play now. This is what they informed me earlier when I okay. asked them. <laughs> well, you know, your, your star player here, your star center will be AJ Pareja. So, who is the most good set to AJ? Yeah. Probably in practice, uh, Clamor did a lot better than Ordonez, but I'm still a big fan of Renz Ordonez's setting abilities. Yes. As uh, Michael Zamora gets us going with a service <laughs> error. That's a free point for Maybank. And I've noticed here, Chiki, and correct me if I'm wrong, well, we're used to uh, um, venues where, you know, it's enclosed. Like, everywhere, there's a uh, upon everywhere. Uh -oh. Here in the Inares uh, Sports Complex in Pasig, there's one area with no seats. Does that uh, change your perspective of the court? Because we see a lot of service errors here as we have a net violation here against the Stemma. That's right. Uh, as a player, actually, hindi mo na napapansin yung mga nasa labas ng court. Eh. Okay. Kasi yung depth perce perception ba, di ba? Parang nagbabago when you... When there are no seats behind you. Yeah. Well, Janli Patrona right now. I missed his name during the pregame. Now I'm going to say it uh, <laughs> over and over again. Janli Patrona, the captain with the service. Here's a combination play. And that is sent back there. Good defense on Makasai. Glamour now going to Makasai one more time. And still denied by the Maybank defense led by uh, De La Peña. They get it across. And that's going to be four touches. Nawala sa bilang ang sistema. Oh, no, pero you know, during their training this week, they said that that's what they worked on, mm -hmm. their receives, yep. their receptions. Well, let's see if the reception is going to be good because it is 3-0 in favor of the Maybank Tigers. Still serving is Jali Patrona. That's a bad reception there, but Ooh. AJ Parea gets the first point now for mm -hmm. Sistema. That was a good adjustment considering the reception wasn't that good. Their tosser, yeah. their tosser was able to handle that. 
All right, before we continue, of course, we're going to send it over now to courtside with Denise Tan. Go ahead, Denise. Guys, Mi Bank head coach Ariel Tendido said that the reason behind their loss in their last game is the lack of preparation. Having only two trainings before the opening, Tendido said that he wasn't surprised that the Tigers were not able to execute their plays properly. Aside from the lack of training, there was also a lack of communication. Tendido now instructed his setter Patrona to be the voice and the coach inside the court. Having said that, he is hopeful that the Tigers will be a lot more vocal and that everything will go smoothly in their favor. Noel and Chiki? Well, you know what? It's, it, I'm actually honored to be with two setters, two star <laughs> setters. Uh, the, Denise Stan, of course, from UST and, uh, and Chiki Pablo, my partner here from UP. But again, you know, it all boils down, after reception, it all, bo all boils down to setting. At yun nga yung pinupuntiria rito ni uh, Ariel Atendido and, of course, Vic Patrona now. Yeah. So after all of that, it's just a one-point lead. Here's Hamza Bin trying to go airborne. That's dug up by who? That is a really good hit by Hamza. You know what? Ang tossers key talaga yun yes. eh. Because if if pangit ang toss mo, kahit na magaling ang strikers mo, wala rin. You cannot execute a good play. And chicken and egg din yan. Sabihin naman ng, ng setter or tosser. Sabihin na yung reception oh, saan, di ba? So the, That's why it's a team sport. It's a team sport. <laughs> Really just can't rely on one. Here's Clamor right. setting up. That's a good set there to Makasai. To Makasai able to nail that one. Onrade will return, which means AJ Pareja will now serve. So it is four to three in favor of Maybank. AJ changing up his serve. Changing it to a jump float, not the jump serve talaga ginagamit niya. Here's Clamor now going over oh. to Espiritu, and Espiritu gets that one off the hands. It's kind of hard to block huh? a rolling rolling ball like that. Oh, yeah. Picks up momentum from the net, That's too. That's right. AJ still getting used to his new serving yeah, style. Yeah, it's a new style. <laughs> and that's going to be a net violation against Sistema. A little over-eager to get that uh, overcooked reception. So now 5-4 to four in favor of Maybach. You know, all of the men's matches, we've, this is our fourth one. Yes. They have all been close. Yes, they've all been close. This one, the game of uh, Maybach against Gilligan's the other time was really close. Yeah, that was, uh, that was three, a good straight game. sets, but it was uh, Dikitan. Yeah, that was a good combination play right there. Yep, and Makasai is able to score. I remember the score in that match was actually 25-23, 27-25, and 26-24. Right. That's so, right. If you take a look at that one again, so Sistema has tied it up at five. Makasai now to serve. Reception by Adorador. Patrona now going to Ivan Bacolo. And Bacolo scored 10 points in their opener. Gets his first point here today. Medyo na una yung dive ni, ano, ni AJ doon. <laughs> right. <laughs> well, now uh, AJ Pareja is actually not replaced by the Libero. So AJ Pareja will play defense in the back line. Hamza Bin oh, serves uh, into the net. That's a free point for Sistema. Uh, we talked about uh, Mohammed uh, Hamza Bin, of course, a former member of the Malaysian national team, who's now a banker. Yes. How about that, huh? A banker. <laughs> All of them are bankers, That's actually. Bacolod right. <laughs> airborne. Here's Clamor now on the quick. That's a left handed attack there from Andrade that never crossed. So, again, a very tight first set. You know, that's one of the drawbacks of having. Um, you know, you getting them all together after working hours. Yeah, that's Doon right. Doon tayo magpa-practice. Magpa Alam mo na, ano ko, na-realize ko ngayon, no? mas marami na ako naririnig nag-uusap inside the court compared yes. to the previous games. Now they're communicating. Well, every match counts. There are only four teams. Yeah. And the uh, inaugural men's division has a great single oh, block there yeah. by De La Peña. So De La Peña makes it an 8-6 to six lead for the Tigers against Sistema. We'll be right back. Stay with us. <laughs> Mr. Richard Gomez, scouting. Spy <laughs> for PLDT. <laughs> <laughs> and he's taking down notes, you know, it's uh, pretty serious. Richard Gomez uh, is the oldest uh, player in this uh, competition. He has to keep up with all yeah. of these young guys. He's been doing very well, actually, Richard Gomez and you of know, Richard, PLDT. Richard, kait anong sport he gets himself into, whatever sport he's, uh, no, no, he excels in it. Right. Be it basketball, rowing, rowing fencing, fencing, you yeah. know. 
Baseball, actually, I, got, I had a chance to cover Richard Gomez uh, as a baseball player. Wow. Yeah, he's a pretty good right fielder wow. as well. <laughs> Here is uh, Rocky Andrade now to serve for Sistema. They're down by one. Patrona now sends it to the back row for Hamza Bin. Great block there by Zamora. They send it down to Ivan Bacola. Bacola dug up. Wow, it's still alive. And it's sent across by Espiritu. Patrona, another back line attack. Wow. And this one is checked. Awesome. <laughs> And you gotta give it to Muhammad Ali Hamza Bin. He's really pumped up to play here in the Philippines. Oh yeah, that was a really good kill right there. That's a two-point lead now for the Maybank Tigers. Ivan Bakolod now to serve. Shot one into the net. Sometimes when you take longer with your serve, those things happen. Actually, in Kalaban Mojan is your fierce. Eh? <laughs> That's why when you get the ball, serve it na. <laughs> <laughs> Mga iba naman, sobra uh -huh. mamadali. Oh, Lakas naman na serve. Oh, yung others, they kiss the ball. That's right. kanya kanya ano, preparation Zamora with a good short serve that time. Bacolod oh. could not cross that line, so he hits it into the net. And look at this, on two errors, we are tied at nine. And now Michael Zamora once again. His picture actually graces one of my articles right now. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> He's like the cover boy of <laughs> one of my articles right now. Just a very good shot by Arnold Cruz, who's also taking photos here right now. Here's the quick set for uh, De La Pena. They go now to Makasait on the push. Combination play once again. Jasper nice. and that's Reception. dug up. Ooh. And... Uh, Grabe talaga, no? Still alive. Oh. And Adorador hits it to the net. Intimidated there by AJ Pareja. So far, the points that system is earning is from their errors. Right. I've also noticed kanina, you know, the men, uh, men's team, when they arrived here, they're jogging and, and talking about pagdaan natin. I mean, ako personally, pagdaan ko, they're all very, very, Uy, ano, uh, good afternoon. They're yeah. all like, they're very, very happy to actually be playing and being playing televised yeah they're very nice actually yeah and it's very, it's been a while that they've been waiting as a door door that's back-to-back -back errors now look at this four consecutive errors now for Maybank to my unit only civic patrona na intimidate yata kay ano eh kay AJ right <laughs> well Zamora continues to serve well, AJ Pareja's presence in the front is really intimidating. He's six foot four. That's a good serve there good coming serve. from uh, Zamora, and Ukan could not do anything about it. Again, you're talking about AJ Pareja, six foot four, very long arms, with a very high volleyball IQ. And he's juggling this between uh, med school, yeah. <laughs> work, and this. See if you All right. Adorador Ooh, again, a wall with Clamor and Pareja. It's more of AJ that time. Pero lumabas yung block. So that'll be a point here for Maybank. You see, Janli pa, uh, Patrona is just really communicating to everyone right now. That's right. I think if you have really big blockers like that, you can do that as a play, e off the block. Right. Uh-oh. Who went Ooh. in the way of Zamora? Who already had a... Para sumigaw na ng mind si Zamora eh. Oh, nga. Di bali, parehong excited eh. <laughs> to get that. <laughs> Let's have another court set report with Denise. Go ahead. Sistema Active Head Coach Kim Ribong said that he is not that disappointed with the result of the first match. He said that the skills were there, but the smashers were just probably going through first game jitters. Going through it all at the same time, he kids. Rebong said it happens to everyone and it's okay. What's done is done and what's important is how they will bounce back in this match. Noel and Chiki? Well, they're trying to bounce back, but the defense of Maybank is starting to uh, hold their own. Ganda ng block doon ni uh, Jasper Adorador. I think it really helps also if you come from the same ball club. Yeah. You know each other's moves. You know how to communicate with each other. That's, well, that's a big thing. Big advantage here for Maybank, actually, because it's a bulk of their team, a majority of their team, coming from La Salle, from that's the 2003 right. champion squad. Of course, that's a long time ago. Gianni oh, Patrona was part of that. Good save there. Zamora across now. Dug up there by Bacolod. Patrona now setting up. Adorador and Jasper. Oh, what a kill. <laughs> Oh, but I think he hurt himself. Uh, it could not. be a case of cramps lang. I mean, it, Jasper's a pretty tough guy. Oh, he's okay. As I mean, since sobrang excited mo, hindi ka papawis, lundag ka lundag, oh, yung cramps come in. I don't, I don't know if that's a problem for setters, though. 
You know what? I've been asking the Lord to give me cramps. I've never had cramps. Are you serious? I'm so serious. Oh my. <laughs> that is so, it's so hard to recover from cramps in the game. Mm, and yeah. uh, luckily, Adorador, actually, Adorador is working on his uh, feet right now. So he might be suffering from minor cramps. But it is now 14 to 12. So it's been a game of spurts so far here in the first set. 14 to 12. May back up by two. Kanina lamang ng dalawa sistema. So let's see which uh, team puts it together here as Patrona serves once again. Very high percentage. Clamor tries to drop it over. Adorador was there. Here's the combination play and nobody there to wow. stop Makasayet. Okay, look at the height here. You have Pareja at 6'4". Makasayet is about 6'2". And uh, meron pa silang isa dyan kanina. Si Onrade is about 6'2 as well. That's right. They're all tall and they all jump so high pa. Right. So now just a one-point lead for Maybach. Ooh, oh, what a serve! Uh, at the corner. So Clamor. Ace there. Dexter Clamor showing us one of his hidden talents. <laughs> be able to bend it like Clamor. Lumigbo yung serve niya And look at Hamza Bin now adjusting. Okay, no more zone 5 for this guy. Oh, it's zone 5 pa rin yun. Pero ready na siya. Uh -oh. Hamza Bin turned back by AJ. Oh, AJ's off to a good start. That was a solid block. There are two AJs. Nga pala magkabilang ka. We have AJ Maliari playing for Maybank. Mm -hmm. And AJ Pareja. For uh, Sistema, so the Battle of Ateneo and Lasal. <laughs> so, <laughs> sorry to insert a little bit of color there. <laughs> Nakaasul kasi si Pareja. Eh. That's gonna be long. So, Clamor with a service error. We are tied at 15. Ganun po kadikit itong ating first set. No team has led by more than uh, two points, if I'm not mistaken. Alam mo, sometimes ang um, overserve like that is, ano, the body's overcompensating. Parang pagod na ba? Right. But it's just the first set. Yeah. I from De La Peña now. Clamor, one hand oh, set. Nobody nice. there to stop Pareja. That was a good toss. And Pareja sends his stem ahead Ooh. by one into our second technical timeout of set number one. You're watching the Philippine Super League right here on Solar Sports. How about AJ Pareja already with four points in this match? And he's back to serve for Sistema up by one. Once again, Noel Zarate alongside Chiki Pablo from the Inares Sports Complex in Pasig City. And uh, Pareja just misses that serve, tried to contest it. We're tied now at 16. A lot of high octane excitement here in this men's matchup between two teams looking for their first victory that's right i think that serve uh missed the line by an inch <laughs> probably even less <laughs> aj with the reception espirito is turned back at the net bacolod wants to convert the gift everybody's ready dump ball here is the oh, attack wow. and rocky Andrade says hello <laughs> not now i have this he said Look at Rocky Andrade here saying, wow, this is going to be the easiest point. I'm going to score the whole day. Better enjoy it. You know, this guy is into his business already, and he was just resurrected, he mm -hmm. said, from his uh, deep sleep before this volleyball tournament came up. Well, he's a former member of the uh, Philippine national Ooh. team, and uh, we, I think he likes it when we talk about it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Good hit there. This time denies Hamza Bin. So now, two-point lead. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, you know, Sistema has uh, about five former national players yes. in their team. You have uh, Angelo Espiritu, Rensu, Chris Makasaet, Rocky Andrade, and of course, A.G. Pareja. And that one is going to go in on an easy drop. So 18 to 17 right now, Muhammad Ali Hamza Bin. The lone import in this men's tournament yeah. from Malaysia. <laughs> but he's an employee of Maybach, so that makes him legal here. Here's Clamor now going over to Zamora oh. and that hit the face of Ukang and he's still okay. One more time around. Patrona has to get it across. Collision there. Third ball coming oh. up. And it is not caught up there by Espiritu. But again, these little collisions, yan ang makikita mo. Pag hindi ka masyadong magkakil, hindi pa kayo masyadong magkakilala, magkakabanggaan pa rin kayo. Kailangan more communication. Right. And now we are tied at 18. 
Here naman sa Maybank, you've got youth uh, national players in Ivan Bacolod and AJ Maliari. Right. Of course, Patrona and uh, Eiffel de la Peña. Oh, yeah. We're, all, we're members of the national, the national team. team. That's a nice quick one. one. It's going to be a lifting violation. It was too nice, Chiki. This is something that the referee. Oh, okay. And again, these little errors, either keeping it close or, you know, you should be ahead by a big margin already. Mm -hmm. Hamza Bin. Nice serve. Good reception, however, from who? And there's a cross court smash wow. coming from Michael Zamora. Really relishes his role as an open spiker. Look at this. Oh, wow. Look at the height of his jump. <laughs> he's not even that tall. He's about 5'8. He does well at the open. There's going to be a free ball coming up there from Patrona. Who? In the air now for Clamor. They go to. Uh, Zamora once again changing direction that time. Hamza Bin has to push it across. That look like was going to go out. Still saved by Espiritu. Zamora cross court. This one will miss. And Big Patrona almost lost his head. Big Patrona, of course, is, he, uh, is married to a very, very good volleyball player as well. Uh, I, uh, we uh, call her Iris Ortega, who's now uh, Iris Patrona, who played in the very first uh, Philippine Super League invi uh, Invitational wow. for uh, Bingo Millionario. And here's Maliari finally getting his time there in front. Zamora turned back there by Maliari. Clamor sending it down to Andrade. Oh. And Andrade has been having a field day. Yeah, he wants to win. You can see it in his face. There's going to be a timeout here called by Big Patrona. Interim coach of Maybach. They are down by two. So coach there just wanted them to habo lang habo kasi masyadong light yung paglaro nila. Well, again, get, you're trying yeah. to keep it light if you're uh, the, the setter, of course. Um, Jan Lee is trying to do his best to keep it light for everybody because he's target. Eh. Yeah, yeah. And he also has to keep them calm. Right. Jan Lee Patrona nice. tries to drop it. Still recovered. Good save. Zamora with great reflexes that time. Collision Ooh. again. Bacolod will try to turn this into something, but he overshoots it. Wow, good eye by Pareja there. You know, okay talaga if you bend it. There was one line spot that called a check ball. I think it's overruled by our official. Mm -hmm. So now this is officially the biggest lead of the game, and it belongs to Sistema. Three points, 22 to 19. Here's the setup now for Bacolod, and Bacolod will miss that one again. Yeah, it hit the net and it rolled out. One more time out here for the Maybach Tigers. Now down by four. Guys, let's go back to basic, all right? Basic volleyball. Once the ball is dead, focus again on the server. Nothing more, nothing less, all right? We can't do our plays, we can't execute our plays if we don't have a receive, all right? Kaya natin yan, kaya yan. One good receive, one good receive. Tagal pa yan. Reception to the guys is right. key. Eh? Right. It's really key. It, that's where it starts. If you have a good reception, you've got a good toss, and then you've got a good attack. And that was the key, of course, going back to the women's division, Amat. That was mm -hmm. the key to uh, PLDT's win over the undefeated TMS Philippine Army. In the first two sets, they had almost 100% yeah. reception, which that's led right. to 40 excellent sets coming from Kaylee Mans over three sets. Eh? Yes. 40 excellent sets over three sets. That's, that's a good one. That's a really good number to have. Zamora. Oh, good coverage there. Patrona now, Maliari, oh, nobody. That was line. Nobody in zone one. Killer talagang zone one, eh. Laging naiiwanan yun, eh. <laughs> Bahay kasi na libero usually zone five, zone oh, six. Nandiyan yung zone one, parang right. wala naman magpupunta ron, eh. Oh. Pero kung cross-court ng, cross ng utility, yan, ingat oh. kayo doon. 23-20. Maybach trying to stay in this first set. 
Good serve. Good reception. And Club Moore. Andrade. That's a free ball going up there by Maybach. A chance now for Sistema. Uh oh, that hit the antenna. Yeah. On the attack there coming from Michael Zamora. Medyo napalakas lang yung toss dun eh. Oh. Maraming nang nagsasabi sa akin, but di lang i-atras ng konting antena na yan kasi ang luwag pa naman doon sa may gilid ng net. Oh, my. <laughs> Especially for the men's game, that's going to be very vital. 23 to 21, yes, that lead sir. is down to two. Clamor now going to Zamora once again. Naabangan that time and that's going to be a drop coming from Andrade. Who has been on his uh, timing here in the first set. That's right. And on Rade, as we take a look at it again, just use his left hand to dink it over. And look at that, he's really pumped up. He, know, he doesn't just hit and hit the ball, you know. He's a thinking player. Now on Rade serving for the set. Good one. Ukang, Patrona, turned back there. De La Peña is blocked by AJ Pareja. And why not? It has been the big man of Sistema providing the points and providing the damage on defense against Maybach. 25-21 is our score at the end of the very first set. Sistema Tooth and Gum Care, taking care of business. We'll be right back. Stay with us. Second set coming up. Highlights, of course, from the first set, along with the numbers from both Sistema and Maybach. Sistema, of course, taking that set by four. They did lead by four attack points there. That's right. And the blocks also, they lead by two against Maybank. But, you know, service. the one number that we don't see there is the errors. And obviously, if Maybank or Sistema won in all those departments, they must have mm -hmm. had more errors as well. Yeah, yeah, that's right. But for it to only be a four-point set. So it's going to be interesting to see how, they, how long they will stay with Dexter Clamor, who did a very good job setting for them. Itong kubuna ng uh, Sistema Smashers. As uh, Renz Ordonez, we don't have any news if Renz Ordonez is injured or anything, but it looks like uh, they're just going to this gambit at this moment. You know, Maybank should come up with really creative attacks because the Sistema Smashers are very tall. Yes, and, and very, very able. <laughs> yeah, very powerful. If they're not tall, like Zamora, they jump high. Right. <laughs> so their attack should be creative. So now we enter the second set. Muhammad Ali Hamza been on your screens there. It will be Jandi Patrona who will be setting things in motion. But uh, as he does that, let's set it over to Denise Tan. Aside from wanting the Tigers to be more vocal to set up the place, Coach Atendido also wants his team to be more vocal in celebrating each and every point. He said that celebrating their kills will not only help them loosen up and react quickly inside the court, but it would also help them build up their confidence. Atendido was also very particular in reminding his boys that before they think about setting up complicated plays, they should first think of ways to perfect their basics. Noel and Chiki? Well, you know, Denise, I'm going to ask you a question also. Maybe you can check on the condition of uh, Renzo Donez, who is not... Uh for uh, para sa sistema because he hasn't played yet he's the captain now we we'll probably get a report on uh, Renzo Ordonez later on because they have been going to Clamor and Clamor has been doing very well yes he has been doing very well you know what napansin ko dito sa Maybank they should talk more para silang the spirit is it's just parang nawala ba well probably one thing also as uh, we take a look at this quick hit one thing probably also working against Maybach as Pareja scores again yeah. Yeah, one thing working uh, against Maybach is sila magkakilala so they feel they don't really have to talk we've been together 10 years guys that's right. right but they need they to talk they need to talk and it looks like Hamza Bin is the one initiating the communication right now AJ Pareja on your screen he's having an excellent game so far 3-0 for Sistema Sistema's having fun right good serve there by Clamor now Clamor setting it up or make that spirit without going to Makasai. Oh. Everybody contributing now for Sistema. Yeah, unlike before, their first game, it was just concentrated on certain spikers. But AJ now, Lang. yeah, but now we ikot na siya. And I, we haven't even seen PJ Rojas in the lineup yet. PJ Rojas exploded for nine points and uh, a couple of aces because of his fantastic jump serve as Clamor hits into the net mm. on his serve. So again, if they're this deep, Kim Rebong's got a really good lineup. 
Four to one right now. I from De La Pena on the serve. That's a good combination oh. play. That is just well executed there by uh, Clamore. You know, one thing that uh, one thing about Maybank is they hardly practice together. Maybe this is also one of the things reasons why they are playing this way right now. Because they all work in the same. Band. But they all work in the same band, <laughs> but but branch. Different branches, yeah, correct. Lang. So it's so hard though to gather them together. Well, there should be a letter from the president, president. <laughs> right? And saying uh, something like that. Here we go. That's a good serve. Good reception right there. Ah, that's a oh wow! Again from Rade. You know, Andrade. He's on a roll. Statement. Yeah, he's on a roll. It's becoming a personal competition now. Who's gonna get more points between Rocky Andrade and AJ Pareja? <laughs> and I'm sure they're both happy that, that they're playing this way. Yeah, the most the happiest guy probably would be Kim Rebong right now. <laughs> Patrona now on the setup for Hamza yeah. Bin. That's a check ball. That's a check ball. So again, uh, if, if if anything. Hamza Bin at the utility spot has actually been making a lot of points. That's right. You know, the lawang tao lang dito ang maging hyper a little bit in Maybank. It would really boost their spirits up. Right, you can see Hamza Bin not very happy with himself after that service error. Back to another four point lead for Sistema. And we have Angelo Espiritu, former national team member. That's right. Patrona now, that's going to be a drop coming from Maliari. Oh, that's a drop. Yeah, that's going to be four touches. Clamor can argue all he wants, but it hit the net first before it was touched by the defenders. Yeah, that's why the referees are on top so right. that they can see. Kaya nga sila may pedestal oh. dyan eh. Pero parang ano, sa angulo dito, parang nauna nga yung uh, block doon. So it looks like Kim Rebong is just going to a new lineup right now because Denise just whispered to us that, you know, healthy naman daw si Ordonez, healthy naman daw si Rojas. But healthy, healthy si Onrade. <laughs> <laughs> and that is a four-point lead for Sistema going into our first technical timeout of set number two. And back with us here, ladies and gentlemen, Rocky Andrade on your screen. Sistema up by four points here in the second set, eight to four. They're also up one set to nothing. Once again, Noel Zarate alongside Chiki Pablo and Denise Tan from the United Sports Complex in Pasig City. Men's division action from the Philippine Super League of Grand Prix. AJ Pareja tries to push it across. Here's Patrona now. Hamza Bin from behind. That gets through Pareja. AJ now sets it up. Zamora on the delay. That's a little too delayed in the air. He tried to do something about that toss and it just went out. Yeah, you're asking about uh, Angelo Espirito, his whereabouts before he played here. That's He's right. actually from the College of St. Benil. Mm. Well, we actually have a list of the eight. Si Renz Hu is also from the College of St. Benil. So there are two of them there. It always helps to have a former college teammate there at Zamora. Goes wow. airborne and Zamora. That was a powerful hit there. Yeah, played for Nakalaga uh, Dito, Irist. So I don't even know where that school is, but he's been playing very well. He's 23 years old. And now he's up to serve. So Zamora now. Patrona. That's a sort of. He's a little kind in the end that time with De La Pena. Makasait. Nice. Oh, that's nice drop right there. Nice. Makasait faked that's that right. he was really going to go down the line. Yeah. He saw that hole and he got it. And means kasi kahit na may hole doon, alam nilang tendency mo down the line, yun ay babantayan nila. Lalaki, oh, lalaki tuloy yung butas. Oh, okay. 10 to 5 right now. Zamora, sharp one. Patrona! <laughs> And that's a just that's a Kaylee Vance move there. <laughs> <laughs> that was a good fast back toss there. So unexpected. They tried to do something about it, but And again, you gotta remember, Jiggy, that the net in the men's game is elevated by that's over right. a foot that's from right. the women's uh, net. Patrona. 
Combination once again. Makasayan against three blockers that time. AJ against one. That's a great block there coming from Jasper Adorador. No one was there to cover that. Yeah, the libero came late. Oh. Of course, who? Renz who? Former St. Vanille uh, libero. Could not get it done. That lead is down to three. Patrona again. Who? Good reception. From the back row, Zamora into the net. Now the error is starting to creep up again against Sistema. You know, I noticed even if uh, they have tall strikers in front, they yeah. still go to Zamora. The back row. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah but if, sometimes you want to vary it in the money. No? You can't be always going to the open hitter. You can't always That's be right. going to the center. And he's a dependable striker. And you can see Adorador's reflexes that time as there's going to be a timeout here called by Sistema. Their once mighty five-point lead is now down to just one. I think their game plays for AJ now. Yeah. With a quick. So That's of course. Look, look at AJ and Rocky combined here. That's already a total of what 15 points just between the two of them. So the two centers doing very well for Sistema so far, but that lead is down to one. If Patrona serving. Who? Here is Bakasai. A collision once again. That's a gift kept alive there by Bakolod. Oh, it's still alive. And Bakolod will get it across. Who once again? They send it to the back row again. Nobody oh, expected wow. that. Oh, that zone five is also a killer. Espiritu. Knocking that one down. Kasi pumunta na lahat dito, nasa open na. Kala sa open ibibigay ito. Kasi gutay-gutay na yung open set. All of a sudden, from behind comes Espiritu to give another two-point lead for the Smashers. Quick set right now. De La Peña able to get that one through. That was kind of hard to cover because he was, he was the, the tosser at the back of the block, blockers were, was expecting a strong hit. That was in off speed. Oh. Yeah. I from De La Peña now to serve. Who? Espiritu going to AJ. AJ, oh. wow, denied by AJ Maliari. That was AJ versus AJ that time. <laughs> and it always will feel good if you are a former La Salle player denying <laughs> an Ateneo MVP. MVP pa. Nadali niya ron. Tied at 11 now. Oh, wow. baka side on the double attack. Pag ikaw yung blocker, sino, sino, sino? That was a good toss. Alam mo na kung minsan na the downplay yung mga tossers. Oh eh. yeah, definitely. No, but it key sila talaga eh, to the sets, not to the strikes. Well, let's see if uh, it can continue here for Clamor, who came off the bench in their first matchup against PLDD. Hamza Bin going across. Zamora. Clamor on a quick wow. set to Andrade. That's it's still got the line by Hamza Bin. And now Hamza Bin attacking. Muhammad Ali Hamza Bin. Alam mo, dito sa, ano, no, sa men's, rarely nagkakaroon ng long rallies because their strikes are just so powerful, like this. Well, Hamza Bin actually started that rally with a dig, and yeah. he finished it off with a cross-court spike. That's right. Tied at 12, Jasper Adorador. Good serve right there. Good reception. And Espiritu, no second ball coming there. As Ivan Bacolod was completely overpowered by the much shorter uh, Angelo Espiritu. That's what the coach was saying. Go back to basics. Have a good reception, and then they'll have a good toss, and then a good strike. Okay, so there's going to be a change in the open spiker position. So from strong to stronger. Yeah, here we have the Rojas. Of PJ Rojas, who's seeing his first action wearing jersey number two. PJ Ross, of course, when he serves, mamaya pa naman sa rotation, but when he serves, Ooh. it's going to be really, really a powerful one. Yes. And that one goes long for Ivan Bacolod. So, Sistema up by two. Two points. Chris Bakasayat now to put it in play. Oh, 
Ooh, that, that is, is a floater. <laughs> And you know, one of the hardest serves to read is that floater. That's right. Because it's a big baba ba eh. That's why it's best to follow the ball. Talaga. And Jasper Adorador was completely dumbfounded. Chris Makasayat, the former La Salle player, wearing blue this time. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder how he feels. <laughs> I'm sure he's used to it by now. There's another drop. It's going to be drop on drop right now. Here is Ivan Bacolod. No drop here. Oh, nice. Goes down the line. Zone one again. Again, it's like, well, now, now the Libero checks in. Yes, I think that the best time to attack zone one is when the center serves. That's the one Libero. So 15 to 13. Hamza Bin. Uh, that's Good read. Long. Good read by AJ Pareja. 16 to 13. The lead still belongs to Sistema, but for how long? We'll find out when we return. Jasper Donator on your screens. His numbers so far in the game. He did score nine points in their opener. He's already up to five right now, but they are still down by three. Maybank is. And how about Chris Makasayet? That's a really big surge for him. Seven attacks in one serve, eight points total. Here's Bacolod now. Try that down the line hit once again. AJ Magliani cannot convert. Combination play. Hello, PJ Rojas going low. That was a, a good idea, but it was just a little bit too long. Too wide, rather. PJ Ross just coming off the bench, so cool pa sa stretching. <laughs> War pa pa lang oh, siya. Oh, pang excited. When you want excitement coming off the bench, you want that kind of energy. And let's see if this play will work. Maliari on the serve. Here we go. Rojas again. Andrade getting it across. Patrona now, back set, back line attack. Coming from Mahalan oh. Hamzabin. And you thought he was going to hit it hard. <laughs> Hamzabin is going to invite more of his friends from Malaysia. <laughs> At the rate things are going. You can see the change in direction right there. Big hole in the center of the court. Let's send it now to Denise Tan. It's obvious that the Smashers are playing a much better game today. And this is, of course, thanks to their improved communication. Rebong, however, who wants more from his team knowing the fact that they have the taller lineup. He instructed his setter, Clamor, to set up more quick plays because this will work to their advantage. Rebong reiterated to Clamor that it's not enough to know who to stop, but it's much more important to know who's going to put in the big numbers for the team. Percentage is key, he said. Noel and Chiki? Well, you know, Kim Rebong wants to send a statement to the two teams that are ahead of him right now, a PLD and Gilligan's, Gilligan's not. Right. Yung uh, opening match nila against PLDT, pwedeng nagkapaan lang sila, but this is supposed to be full strength. And look at the power of PJ Ross in that open position. Cool na cool pa siya, yeah. no? After that hit, cool na cool lang eh. Well, he knows he's on TV. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's the big part of it. But of course, itong si uh, Rojas played for Adamson University in the NCAA. Conrade. Andrade on that serve. Here is Patrona now. Ivan Bacolod oh. <laughs> just got to the line. Ito may reaction dun espirito ng mga hulog niya. Namutla siya. A beach volleyball player siya. So pag namutla siya, obvious na obvious, di ba? <laughs> Wala kasing buhangin eh. <laughs> That's kind of hard, you know? You're, you've been known as a beach volleyball player. All of a sudden, you play indoor. Which is the harder one? I thought you played oh, both. Beach is so hard. Oh, yeah. But what is the harder to adjust to? Beach? To indoor or indoor to beach? I think uh, indoor to beach is harder to adjust to. Uh -huh. And there it, will be another point here for Maybach. Because if you indoor, you can use the aircon, you can use the sa floor, the oh. ilaw. But there, when you're outdoor, the sand palang gets your energy, it saps it. Plus the heat. Tapos yung ano pag pipi heat ka padu sa buhangin, wala ka sa patos. Oh, lakon sa chip. <laughs> Yeah, wow, good, good eye right there. Makasai, it was tempted. It's like a high fastball in baseball. You know it's high, but you're tempted to swing at it because yeah. it is high. So that's a good, uh, masasabi natin, good recognition there. Here's the serve. Yep. Oh, man. That was strong. <laughs> but Adorador was up to the task. Espiritu now, Clamor, AJ. It's been a game of digs so far here for AJ. 
Oh, AJ with the block, though. That's a wall. <laughs> AJ the wall. <laughs> Dr. Pareja very soon. Right now, it's 20 to 17. Timeout, Maybank. Long ball, long ball mo siya. Kasi nakita mo, mag-isa na lang siya, umabol na lang yung middle block, eh, di ba? So, ilong ball mo, targeted mo yung ano, down the line. Tapos, ah, uh, tawag dito, dyan, dyan, baba mo onto yung set, baba mo onto yung set. Okay? You know, you, it's not just the strikers who you should read it, it's also the blockers who right. you should read. Para maiwasan mo. Sometimes nga ginagamit mo, palihis, pacheck na yung mga ganon. You don't you really have to go through them. As you can see, the excellent sets, they're actually canceling each other out. Jandy oh, Patrona eh. is actually ahead of that, but it's just the, the reception and then the execution pagdating sa, sa open spikers. I feel sa open spikers, lamang na lamang itong sistema right now. And they're not even the top oh. scorers. That That's was a Ross. free point for Maybank. <laughs> Ross just hits it into the net. Did actually, you see the net bounce? That's right. The top scorers have actually been uh, Rocky Andrade and itong si AJ Parea. So the mm. open spikers are starting to contribute as well. That's right. Now, Janli Patrona. Who? Combination now. Chris Bakasai goes through. Good coverage there by Patrona. Here's Jasper Adorador. Through Ooh. the blockers. No one was there for that ball. Although the ball went down really slow, it's just that nobody was there. And I expect mo kasi, like, look at where who was already. Yeah. Alam mo malakas niya. Eh, oh, and expect niya cross court this. And lead is down to one. Jali Patrona. Oh. oh, barely, barely missed that one. That was a good angle for a short serve. Yeah, it, if that had gone in, I think they would have earned the point for and, that. And this was the comment I was about to make earlier, uh, Jinky, before we had a timeout. Yeah. They do have another world-class setter in their lineup in Hansel Go. That's right. And now Hansel Go will be seeing his first action. Remember, when La Salle won that championship in 2003, they went to a 4-2 set. They had two setters in their lineup. That's probably the last time it worked in the history of volleyball. <laughs> oh, we don't see that very often That's anymore. Right. Oh, hands up in! Medyo matas yung bola that time. And Clamor, you know, sometimes setters, and I'm sorry to say this because setters are, Denise Stan and, uh, was a setter, and uh, of course you are a setter. You wait for the second ball. Yes, Hardly, you do. Hardly, hindi na kayo magda-dive for that first ball. Pero nakita mo yun, they became creative in their attack. Eh? Instead right. of really hitting it, they just hinulog na lang. Went okay. over the blockers. AJ oh, is denied boy. by AJ. That was Bagliari versus Pareja, and Bagliari won. Now tied at 21. Now it's Estema's turn to call a timeout. Tingnan nyo lang yung kamay. Pag nakita nyo humugot, papalo yan, pare. Pag nakita yung pinalo, tsaka lang ano. Susuportahin nyo natin yung nasa likod yung blocker. Yung ano din blocker, sigaw tayo sa likod. Kita nyo naman eh. Drop, 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 para alam nung nasa likod. Say, pare, ganun dyan eh. Hindi nga lumunos yung palo nila. Kaya kanina ko pa sinasabi siya, nagsabayan nyo yung ulo, ulo ko kay Kang. Pag-apat ang palo na lumubang sa blocking natin. Tumating na ang hulog niya. Kailangan talaga bantayan ng strikers, eh. their move, their body right. language, the form of their hand, because you can really tell kung ihuhulog eh, or if they're going to really strike that ball. Sometimes mga chiki telegraph na yung forma pa lang nila. Uh -oh. Galing sa spike, bigla na lang sila magsistretch out. Pero right. sometimes, and I've spoken to other volleyball players about this also, sometimes you're already set with how you're going to, uh, yeah, to block also. them. That when they change in mid-air, it's so hard, hard to change to your adjust. defense. Correct. So unahan lang yan. Look at Clamor, that was close to a lifting violation, but it still was not successful as now Maybank gets its first lead of the second set. Ano magandang uh, buelo, no? Galing kang five points down. They were five points down, 10-5 earlier, but now they lead by one. Si Clamor tried to do something with that reception. Eh? That's why naganon yung toss niya. Well, who with a better reception this time? They go to Espiritu oh! into the net. Errors and errors and errors. And that's what's giving the Maybach the lead. Zamora will return. Rojas will sit. Zamora will serve. Or Zamora will receive from zone one. But again, it's a big problem right now. Parang not deflate. Parang ka na-flatan eh. Ang lapit-lapit mo na sa pupuntahan mo, na-flatan ka pa. Oo nga, parang... Pero malayo pa yan. Ah, let's see. How they adjust to this. Oh! Chris Makasai says Merry Christmas to one and all. Sabi ni Chris, tama na, tama na. 
<laughs> but they're still down by one. Pinerson na lima kasahit ito. Damn. Saka walang blockers. Oo nga. AJ. Bad reception. We are tied at 23. Good service ace there. Bukang usually does so well with the receptions. But right now, they have a problem. Tied at 23. Sino ba chance? Sino tayo mag-match point? Okay? Usap tayo. Three receivers. Sino mag-receive? Ikaw. Atiin nyo, atiin nyo, atiin nyo. We have a chance, match point, okay? One good receive, one good receive, okay? Go, attack! Tigers on three, one, two, three! He's just happy to be here, I think. See, Muhammad, why don't you go, 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 come on, come on, come on! I mean, what a break this is, you know? You're, you're a banker, you're, you're thinking about numbers the whole yeah, time, your entire stress. career, and all of a sudden, you're sent to the Philippines to, yeah. to be with your company, but to play volleyball. To play, what a, what a job. <laughs> and this is actually, I, I don't, I'm going to have to ask if this is a paid leave. I, I guess this is a paid leave. Oh, yeah, <laughs> I think so. Hansel go now on the combination. Hamza Bin turned back there by Onrade. They will set it up, but Hansa Bin is out of position. On right there, blocked there by a oh, Good coverage. One more time, back oh, oh, Wow, with a stare after that strike. And you're gonna, you gotta love it. Some boys, mo lang, some men's division, mo lang may kita, may halong stare down the ganon. Oh. <laughs> and he shakes it off. So I mean, I'm sorry, I did that. Oh, here we go. Look at this. Look at this. Coming from the open position. Oh, did you see the swing of his hands, right. arms? Talaga. Sistema, oh, oh! oh! AJ Maliani! And that was against Makasayet. So Maliani ties it up at 24 now, race to 26. Makasayet was contesting that, uh, that hit there. There's going to be a substitution here. Our first look now at uh, Justin Marchadech. Justin Marchadech is actually also a player of uh, LaSalle. So Marcia Dech right now coming in as the serve specialist. What nationality is that? Uh, it's supposed to be Indian, but we have to ask him. Yeah. Good serve by Marcia Dech. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, Yari puts it away and now set point for Maybank. They so, have to be really careful with their receptions. You yeah. don't want that happening. That's right. Marcia Dech once again. I was very close. I, I know. I thought it was going to hit the net. And Spirit of the Coverage oh. and Maybank ties it up. And they get the set. Sistema was leading 95% of that second set. But when it mattered most, Maybank pulls it out 26 to 24. And we are guaranteed at least four sets in this matchup. We are tied at one set apiece. We will be right back. Stay with us.